So I'm having a lot of fun with this game. Like Far Cry 6, even though it's been a while, like the me uh, like the memories uh, are starting to come back just slightly, but it's like one of those games where I could just like play a few times over and over and still have a lot of fun like it's the first time. So welcome back guys to another episode of Far Cry 6. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. In the last game, I mean not last game. <laughs> in the last episode, we began and uh, Danny he started on his journey. Well, technically, it was not intentional. He, uh, the ship he was on was shot up, and they he pretty much got stranded on the island where the leader of the guerrilla was uh, was located. But now we broke through their blockade, and now we are on the main island. But by doing so, now I finally unlocked all the like weapons and like outfits that came with the gold gold edition so i got some pretty uh, good weapons that i could use so taking on like the checkpoints and like some of the soldiers will be slightly easier who knows because usually well when you purchase like ad additions like uh, deluxe editions or like ultimate editions usually the weapons and everything they give you will is like more mostly like a starter pack like give you a step ahead of the curve but when you like progress into the game and then like big bosses and like elite soldiers come out, that's where like you don't really use it anymore. So, but hey, I mean, so far I've been using the weapons a lot and it's a lot of fun. And I have not done anything off camera because I want to save it all for you guys. So right now we are currently located in um, uh, Mon Montero's like camp where their hidden camp or farm is. And we're going to check out like what they want to see like how they can uh, help us if we help them so without anything else let's get into it okay let's check out the camp Shit. I like your style Gideon. I'm Lola aka goddess of goods and gossip I sell everything from guns to toilet paper on the black market and none of that one ply bullshit either my products are premium plush baby premium content hmm. I'm Lola aka goddess of goods and gossip I sell everything from go we'll check you out later my bad what's this what can I do for Anyone you like Danny Benito sorry guys <laughs> Okay, run uh, Bandito uh, operations by deploying leaders and recruits. Leaders will join you upon completing operations in Yaron's stories. Recruits can be added by freeing hostages, defacing posters, and destroying billboards. Ooh, what kind of pistol is that? Assign leader. Okay. Okay, so wait, I guess we wait a minute. Benito. Feel like being a pirate again? We need resources in. Oh wait, no, no, we already read that. Benito, feel like being a pirate again? We need resources, intel, allies. Only you can get them. I'll send you anyone I rescue. They will be happy to stick it to Anto. Soon you'll have your own little pirate army. Benitos bandidos. <laughs> I can't lie to you. I like the sound of that. Start sending people my way, and I'll keep an ear to the ground for opportunities. Viva Libertad! Viva Libertad! Has it been a minute? Nope, 10 more seconds. Lost the experimental FND weapon running from a Jaguar. <laughs> Should we do Danny? Oh, okay, so I choose which one? Do we need medicine or gasolina? So, because it says losses up to two, so this is a little bit more dangerous. Let's do hidden highways. Oh, we lost one. <clears throat> we made it to the cave undetected, but the FND already had a force waiting at the entrance. Slip past. 
Nice. And no losses. Step three. Okay, so this is the last one. Uh, but is it along? Jaguar Tamer, clear the floor. We can get metal or medicine. Or we cannot lose anyone and just use gasolina. So we got a new pistol. Nice. Hey, I like this. Oh wait, no, no. Surveyor. Okay, so these two missions are his specialty. So let's send them on this one. Oh, by the way, guys, I bought the other DLC, Lost Between Worlds, because I have everything else but that one. And I want to show you guys. Oh, a special Can anyone compete in these hey, legendary fights? Yo, 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 yo. Come fight. Hold up. Maybe in a bit, but I kind of want to uh, do a main mission right now. Oh, look at that. I don't even have to do anything. Lost tourist? Listen, Carlos. I know you don't trust me or Clara or Libertad. Or well, the other little come mierda she sent. And I don't blame you. We have no history here. You got that right. What else you know? I know that Napoleon El Pequeño stole your land. I know that the poison he sprays on your fields is killing your people. I know that you are sick. And you would rather die than ask for help. Don't throw anything away that you can use. The depot where they store the poison? Burn it to the ground. The dusters. Let's spray the tobacco. Rip them apart. The fumigators in the fields. Kill them all. You got a jefe. Send me a postcard. Okay, so it looks like he's making dinner. Crocodile meat. To me. Should I talk to her because I'm already here or should I do the mission? Wait, let's talk to her because I'm like, looks like this is m more of a like free roam um, mission. I need your help to find the lieutenant. Our soldier friend said he saw Napoleon El Pequeño's private island. So you and me are going to take a boat from a dock in Siniestra to Cayo Ria Real. We take out this Singao and Jose's whole operation crumbles. But keep this between you and me, okay? Papa's got enough stress to deal with right now. Okay, so help me catch a lieutenant on Jose's private island. See you at the boat. Ride. Oh, so. Oh, yeah, this is like a Far Cry 5 horse. And behold, uh, I forgot what uh, what the father said. Behold, it was a white horse, uh, white horse, and hell followed, and hell followed him, or something like that. See? So for horses, you can press X and it travels to destinations for you. See? Like, I'm not even touching the controls. But for cars, you can't do that. Like, you need to actually drive there. Wait, is that? <laughs> well, I guess between the horse and the bull, the horse won. But 
the thing is, it doesn't go like uh, it's full speed. You gotta like kind of push uh, to like make it go faster. I mean, there's a lot of things to do here. Easy now. <laughs> okay. Hope there's no sharks. We are taking a lot of risks for one lieutenant. You want to complain? You can swim. Oh, <laughs> nice boat. Is it yours? No, I stole it. Papa taught me how to hotwire tractors when I was a kid. Boats aren't so different. Hey, we have to get Carlos a doctor. Hmm, good luck. He's coughing blood. He needs help. Papa took me fishing once, south of Costa del Mar. He's a hell of a rancher, but a shit fisherman. No patience, couldn't cast. Kept snagging his line on the bottom. Even hooked himself in the lip. <laughs> Got so pissed, he threw a stick of dynamite in the water. Killed a lot of fish, but also put a fucking hole in our boat. We swam five kilometers back to shore. All these boats stopped to help, but Papa told them to fuck off. What does this have to do with Carlos being sick? I'm saying that the day Carlos Montero gets help, is the day hell freezes over, Danny. Coño, you Monteros are stubborn. No me, just Papa. <laughs> sure, sure. Shut up. Fucking tobacco. It was supposed to make our people rich. That's what Anton said anyway. See? That's how he got elected. Yes, and a lot of us voted for him. We believed in his promises. We thought it was going to be like the old days again. Like some kind of fantasy. We were so fucking wrong. If we want to change things, someone has to whip us all into shape. Bring us together. And it's not going to be Papa. Carlos doesn't have a plan. His plan is don't tell anybody what the fuck you're feeling ever. Don't trust anybody either, especially your own daughter. Just fucking react to whatever Napoleon el Pequeño throws your way. He's old school. Reminds me of my headmaster in the orphanage. Strict, tough as shit. But if he liked you, he had your back for life. Hmm. That kind of thinking is gonna get us all killed. We can't keep reacting to Jose. It's not working. We need to try new things. Be agile. Stay one step ahead of that little hijo de puta until he's dead. I'm with you. Good answer, Danny. Mexican. Tobacco out here has been vivido. Can't even smoke our own anymore. Come mierda. Jose Castillo. Shit. ¿Qué pasó? Jose fucking Castillo. Anton's bitch of a nephew. Lo veo y no lo creo. What's he doing? He's uh he's with the lieutenant we were looking for. It looks more like a scientist. Mr. Koseya. No. You no. might hit the lieutenant. Oh. Fuck. Hey. Over there. Oh, shit. Come, boy. I need to know where that scientist is going. Let's search his place for intel. Let's go. Maybe his friend by the helipad can help me.
Well, at least the first one was a headshot. <laughs> Nice. Not necessary, but nice. Okay, so there's four more. Congratulations, Jewish Tavianas. You have made it to Jose Castillo's exclusive inner circle. I hope you realize how special. I am very, very selective. Here on my island you are free. Free from the constraints of your responsibilities. Free from your duties and the mundane. Here you can embrace your inner animal and satisfy your primal urges. This, my true friend, is my gift to you for your undying. Oh, damn it. Meter action against Castillo's regime will increase the heat meter. At first, the military presence around you will increase. Next, Castillo will send his special forces to hunt you down. All right, now let's check out the guy that he stabbed. What's this? Feed. <laughs> nice. Okay, an evening at Cayo uh, Villarreal. It says Jose has a villa on the north side of the island. Let's go check it out. Maybe there's something that tells us where he went. Hey, no problem, man. I got you. Damn, it took me a while to hit that dog. As fuck. Even for a thing. Come, K9000. Hey, nice. Hey, what's up? Oh, looks like there's a crate over here. Shotgun! Well, my weapons are better. I gotta like change the scope on this thing, like have it zoom in a little bit more. So the weapons are fine, but I just need to upgrade them. Hola, perito. Okay. What 
っと Only got six arrows left Well, I hope that there's like an ammo cache nearby I haven't used the Supremo yet But then again, I'm trying to like keep on the down low, but if reinforcements come then that's why I'm gonna use it I see you engineer Shit they got a sniper Got you. Fuck that shit. So basically, the soldiers here have just been chilling. <laughs> No password, idiota. Let's see what we got here. I guess he was that confident no one's gonna hack in. El pequeño has a fucking... Written on a porno mag? Your <laughs> chamber filled with outcasts. It's under the lighthouse just south of here. Cojones. Can you let me in? Blood drunk. Done? That I always to have my name. Damn. I'll stay and see what else I can find. Suerte, Danny. Jose has a bunker uh, under the lighthouse. Rescue the prisoners. I say my aim is getting a lot better, but just like at the beginning, like trying to uh, trying to get the dogs, because I'm mean, like I don't know why, but the dogs seem to like be more difficult to like uh, shoot than the people. Like I'm pretty sure like I am able to hit it, but the game is just saying like Nah, man, you missed. So it looks like enemies just start to respawn. But I mean, like, it is a nice island, though. Yeah, now enemies are starting to respawn. There again.
Damn, bro, what are you trying? You trying to shoot me with the RPG? Wait, where? 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 I didn't even see them. Oh, I see those shadows. Please, I shouldn't be here. Estoy tan contento que me encontraste. Gracias. Jose is a monster. What's wrong with you? But I didn't do anything. Damn, they just like watch the show? Espada, Jose was using this place as his own little torture chamber. He had outcasts in there, but I freed them. Enfermo mental. I should have been I found where that scientist works. This Ingao we saw earlier. His lab's in Refmira. Meet me there. Okay. Then how are you gonna tell me what's really going on? You'll know when I need you to know. Okay. Napoleon El Pocuento? Oh, uh, Pocuento? I don't know how to say that. It's a spada. Hey. Papa's not so good with technology. He asked me to send you a photo of what the poison looks like. I've messed with poison before, but that's real thoughtful of him. I wouldn't go that far. Papa doesn't trust outsiders, but I've seen what you can do. Check the photo. And show him you know what the fuck you are doing. Okay, so this photo. Now, before we do that, uh, let's do this mission. Ah, a new guerrilla. Damn pig. Midnight, and he's supposed to take over at 4 a.m. Let me get hey, a magic horse. horse. <laughs> That's a good horse. Poison containers. So basically, everything that's poison. But if we're gonna get gonna go against poison, might as well use fire then. So I got some Molotov cocktails and everything. You know, I'm gonna, uh, instead of doing like automatic traveling, I'm gonna uh, do this on my own. There, see? A lot of scraps and a lot of uh, outcasts freed. Hey, where are you going? Let's go! 
So these two are pretty close by, and that one is like kind of like on its own. Easy. I think they just ran one, uh, ran over one of their own dogs. <laughs> okay, we're here. Carlos, it's Danny. Danny from Libertad. I know. You think I forgot or something? No, I just didn't know if. Forget it. I'm coming up on some of Castillo's poison. Look for yellow containers. Crop dusters and fumigators got the poison too. Okay. Take an alarm. I'm on it. Let's have, yeah, let, uh, because they have an alarm. Well, I mean, like, I could use my Supremo, but I still don't want to risk it. No. There's a lot of dogs. I wonder if... Oh, okay, I was gonna try to use that to climb over. So this thing's kind of fortified. Secret plan is? Danny. Okay, that was a big mistake. Huh? Oh hell, uh-uh, no. We ain't letting this one out. <laughs> Had to be right next to the truck. Can't poison anyone else with that shit anymore. Oh shit, they got a tank. Is there still more poison here? I mean, it's still showing up as yellow, uh, like a yellow inside search area. There we go. But on the other hand, hey, we took out a tank. Oh, shit. Get in K9000. Wait, can he get in? Man's best friend.
I, uh, I refilled my arrows. So who knows? Maybe I could stealth Officer. this. Rank won't protect you. Sneaky. Oh, they got more snipers. Wait, there's another one? Mm, bug. Now, K9000. Oh. I know what I was and report back. They're still out there. Okay, doing good, doing good. Okay, I learned something new. Oh, okay. So I need like a grenade or something. Don't one of these guys have an RPG or that works too? He'll be back. And depleted uranium. Keep some of that depleted uranium by those anti aircraft sites. Wow. Snatch me some so I can gift you more Supremos. And if you blow those cannons to bits, you can fly free as a bird in Yara skies. Uh, let's see. Alright, so I definitely need to change. I wonder if I can do it right now, actually. Okay, I, get, I, I can only do it at the workbench, but one thing for sure, I need to like change uh, one of these into like an explosive. I wonder if there's a mounted gun somewhere. <laughs> I 
I got enough ammo. <laughs> Oh, that's why. Oh, great. More voice on this drive. And one step closer to earning the old man's trust. I wonder if this can reach it. This thing has a mounted machine gun, so I'm gonna bring it over here to use it to destroy the anti aircraft gun. Okay, so that's not working. Yeah, uh, of yeah I'll come back to that later. Cause I'm like I'm bound to like come back here anyways. Korea high out. Hmm. This thing's actually pretty close to this. I wonder if they have a workbench. Hey, over here. Okay, time to change a few things on the Supremo. Proximity charges. Yes. Oh, that would be great. And let's add another one too, yeah. Mods, mods. I can only choose one of them because I only have enough for Supremo Bond. Uh, let's go with this one. If I can change the appearance to look wait to make it look like my outfit then that would be great. Incendiary rounds. Last rounds. Armor piercing. So my outfit is specifically for armor piercing. So oh, I kind of want the incendiary rounds too. <laughs> Do 
Let's change that. Uh, yeah, we need more gunpowder. And as for charms, let's see what we could do. Cigar cutter, kill star, curse lantern, hologram, or yada libre. Now for the primary weapon, this. Let's see what we could do with you. Now we need to put a scope on you. <laughs> we can't really do much more because I'm out of gunpowder. But I really wanted to put a scope on this. A uh, better scope, I mean. Oh, you can't change this. Never mind. But overall, I say that was a, that's a pretty good like uh, addition. Let's try that again. <laughs> Yo, that was dope. <laughs> officer. Oh, that's an officer right there. Okay, so these guys are much higher level than me. Oh, why? Oh, why run down that hill when you could just slide down? <laughs> so I'm guessing I gotta burn all these. There's no one up in the guard towers. More poison destroyed. And one step closer to earning the old man's trust. Okay, there we go. Man, if they actually put someone in the guard towers, then that would have made things a lot more difficult. Okay, so there's another officer there. Yes, 
Okay, so the area is cleared out. Now we blow it up. Hundred percent. Carlos, it's done. Good. Let's see if Napoleon and Pequeño gets the fucking message. I got more work for you. Come back to camp. Trying to get lost, tourist. I'm just burning the tobacco uh, just for the hell of it now. <laughs> Hey, you're good, man. This can't be happening. No. Yeah, this is what they showed me earlier. Shit, truck. Okay, so we finished one for uh, the old man Montero. You're a new face. One, one second, guys. I got a text. Okay. All right. What does the old man want? I got word that Jose's pissed about his poison. You fucked up his operation good. Maybe I was wrong about you. Maybe. So now I'm going to ask you for a favor. Our people are rotting in Jose's prisons. One of them, Miguel, he's like a son to me. We'll need a prison truck to bust them out. Steal one, then meet me at the gas station near the prison. We drive in, grab our people, and leave before anyone gets smart. I'm trusting you with this tourist. Don't fuck it up. Okay, then. Don't take too long with that prison truck. Gog fighting. Hey, hola. Think you got what it takes? Hey, yo. Yo, 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 yo. Let's try this. <laughs> so, you want to join the fun? Think your bird is a champion? We will find out. Cock fighting. So, close range, long range, and jump attack. Dodge. Taking damage and missing attacks increases the rage bar. When full, trigger the Gallo Super. Who's so, some of these uh, birds I got from the Gold Edition. Frosty. El, Dra this El Dragon. El Rival. El Rebel. I'm gonna go with him. I like the blue. Watch this! A champion enters the ring! Can anyone compete with the vicious claws and razor sharp beak of this gigantic guy? I have no competition waiting. Round one, fight! Ooh! Hey! 
believe you won that. Round two, fight! Oh! <laughs> we did it at the same time. I should have won that one. That's my boy. Even matches his outfit, so I really like that. All right, that's enough of that. Oi, que bola, papacito. Can I talk at you for a second? Maybe later, but first, I'm gonna help with the blood ties. That was a lot of fun. Okay, I get it, man. Damn. Now I think about it, why am I running? Let's get a horse. <laughs> I like the transition of like, when you uh, go into camp, then it, you go into like, third person view, but when you're like... Uh, uh, in third person view, but then when you go out, uh, out of it, then they're like, Okay, now uh, this is where like you may get attacked or Where's the horse? Oh, there it is. You may get attacked or this is like outside of the safe zone. Instant horse. Yeah. Ah, see. You're okay. Can't sign it yourself? He, uh, I, I worry if this piece of shit phone would just do what I. And Candela, this guy. Oh, he hung up on us. I'm not part of it. So. Huh? Gunshot. All right, we're here. Why do you want this guy so bad anyway? El come mierda checks all the tobacco leaves for the vivido process. We fuck up the leaves, we fuck up the cancer drugs, we fuck up Napoleon el Pequeño's operation. Make him look bad in front of old Uncle Anton. Lord of heat. How you wanna do this? We kill soldiers until we find him. And then? And then we kill more soldiers. Simple. I like it. Kill, kill, kill. To me. Well, then again, that's pretty much all of Far, uh, Far Cry games. Sniper. Oh, she's disappointed. 
engineer. Is that it? Here. Better watch my step. What's the hold up, tourists? Check the baseball field near Verdera. They always park trucks near there. Okay. Gracias. What's the hold up? I'm helping out someone. <laughs> Okay. Well, I still got him. So they got two alarms. This is General Jose Castillo with an important announcement. While El Presidente has been rebuilding paradise, I have been rebuilding our military. I am sure you are all very impressed. You should be. Our forces have grown tenfold over the last six months. Our military might have exceeded even my greatest expectations. Now, thanks to me, the world Damn, this guy's a narcissist. Because of me, because of me. What? Enter the lab. I hope we can drive that. <laughs> Neatly written note. Prove production operations. Uh, okay. Get away from me! Fuck me, mierda! Mierda is right. You look like shit, hermanito. Hermanito, oh. you've been hunting your brother this whole time? Who the hell are you? Why didn't you just tell me? Alejandro, come on. We're going home. Yeah. Vete pal carajo. Suéltame. Cojones. ¿Qué es lo que te pasa? I'm not going anywhere. I told you before, and I am telling you now. I believe in Castillo. I believe in Diviro and Jose. 
He's seen the vision through. Napoleon el Pequeño is a slave driver. He's fucking loco. <laughs> That's the person trying to kidnap me. You change your name. You change your uniform, but you are still a Montero. And Papa still got a machete up his ass. And you are running through the jungle like you did when you were five. Except now you kill people and you got yourself. What is it? The spike? The sword. How clever. What? You are going to stab me now? Papa, I'm sick. I don't care. Papa gave up on me a long time ago, and you know it. Family's at beach, no? That's what I hear. We should split up. Not a word about this to Papa. Come, boy. So that's why uh, when we were on the island, uh, she told us not to shoot because we might hit the uh, we might hit the lieutenant. But that's why because it's a family member. Hola, you good? See. Si. I never thanked you for helping me track down Ali. I wasn't exactly honest with you. All good. Just glad I know the real story now. I was worried you wouldn't help if you knew my brother was military. He's... a traitor. See, si. But he's still family. Come back to camp soon. We got more work to do. But before we do that, let's go help out the old man. Person, uh, your gear with spray cans found around Yara. Okay, so spray cans are pretty much like hey. for hey. customizing. You got something for me? Word is the artist Zenya Zayas wants to meet you. You're making quite a name for yourself around here. Thanks a lot. Alright, let's take a look. I still don't have enough gunpowder. Alright, so I just need more gunpowder. Alright, time to slip and slide again. That is a lot of fun, actually. I wonder if this car can get me to where I need. Let's roll, boy! Oh, so he sings along. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. That uh, that the character sings along with the song. That's pretty cool. I bet the voice actor had a lot of fun too. Ah, uh, I want to hear more. Yeah, I know. That's far. Oh, they truck. Oh, I thought we were over here. <laughs> My bad, guys. <laughs> Come get me at the gas station. 
On my way. Carlos, almost there. Good. Bring the truck inside the garage. You got it. I'm guessing these are the billboards that we need to like destroy. Master of disguise over here. Shut up and get in the back. Okay. Hey, it actually looks pretty good on him. But then again, I, I said the uniforms actually look pretty cool. But it looks like it's. But since it's white, it's a little bit difficult to keep clean. Consider even a, if it's a combat to uniform. I broke out. It used to be a school. I sent my kids there. How long were you inside? Eight months. Maybe more. 18 hour days in the fields getting whipped and breathing in poison fucks with the memory. Sounds like hell. See, si, but I had Miguel. We kept each other straight. Yeah, you said he was like a son to you. Toughest motherfucker I know. Raised him like he was my own. Taught him to box. He almost made Senor Yara before we got taken. How did you get out? Camila snuck in one night, sliced up three guards, took two bullets to her shoulder, grabbed the hostage and sprung me and Philly. Oh yeah. Sounds like his father. That's my girl, but she couldn't find Miguel, and by that time there was too much heat. So we left him behind with more of our people. Just hope there's something left of him. Wow. So basically no these close. guys... No more talk. So basically these guys uh, had a rough. Carlos Montero, what are you doing here? Where's Miguel? I don't know. The car took him somewhere in the prison. Mierda, it's off. We walk. Go. I'll find Miguel. If you get caught, it's you against the fucking army. It's okay, Papa. I wear my big boy pants. Crazy motherfucker. Meet us at the gas station when you go to. Suerte. So I choose the pinga. I don't even know what this guy looks like. So basically, us against the uh, against an army. Typical. Dude, his back must be hurting from carrying the game. Got eyes on an engineer. Is that an alarm? So there's an al another alarm. Are the alarm boxes like stronger? Because I can't like destroy them with like bullets or blades. You better be Miguel. Who the fuck are you? Danny. And Carlos Montero sent me. Okay, so we found the gift. But we need the key card. Prison incident report. Hey, uh, guys, uh, so I just want to make it clear for me when I get collectibles, 
uh, what I do is like I just like scan them and I read them on my own time, not when I'm on mission, because I like to finish missions and then read them. So that's just who I am. Every true Yaren knows there is nothing more important than family. I walk in my oh, so there's two more alarms, man. This place is really locked up. No, we don't. Yeah, so like some of the uh, like these alarm boxes, Help I could destroy easily, but some of them are like armored. Hey, there you go. And look at that. No alarms, nothing. Lead the way. Carlos. Found Miguel. Good work, tourists. Now get him out of there and meet me at the gas station. Okay. Okay, so automatically so changes to Carlos. Up ahead. Up ahead where? The gas station. I know it's hard, but you gotta trust me. Everything's gonna be okay now. Carlos said he took you in, but you boxing, that kind of thing. He didn't teach me shit. I schooled him. How long you know, Carlos? A few days. Carlos don't make friends with outsiders. Anyone else waiting with Carlos? I said it. You ask a lot of questions. Just him. Almost there now. All right. Nice and clean. No alarms. There he is, Senor Yara. Come on, get in. Hell yeah, brother. I knew you'd come for me. Coño, Sere. You look like shit. I thought you motherfuckers were on rations. <laughs> Still a dig. Still dry. Good for you. I'll drink his. <laughs> Miguel. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't come for you sooner. I tried. You know I'd never forget you. Enough bullshit, Carlos. We do what we do to survive, mi hermano. Enough talk. Give me that fucking guitar. <laughs> Good 
did good, tourists. When I first saw you, I wanted to gut you like a crocodile, but you're Montero now, Danny. Gracias. So, do I call you Papa now? Shut up and drink. <laughs> <laughs> ah, chorizo. Damn, how many did you have? <laughs> Second son, complete. Alright guys, I'm gonna end it here, so that was Far Cry 6. Now, we have gained uh, like trust in the Monteros. We are basically one of them now as the... Um, crap man, I keep on forgetting his first name. As the old man uh, Montero said that now we are one of them. And we helped out uh, Espara find, uh, uh, find a lieutenant, which was actually her younger brother. So basically her younger brother believes in Castillo and Vivero and tobacco uh, production. So that's why we couldn't hit Jose because the little brother was so close to him that she was afraid that we were going to hit him as well. So it was pretty messy shot. But now we broke out uh, Miguel, who uh, Montero considered as one of his sons. So now we basically uh, reunited his like family, oh, except for the brother, of course. But what I noticed was at the campfire when uh, Miguel hugged uh, hugged him, that look that he gave Aspara, and I'm guessing like he has like a bit of a like bad history between him and her. I don't know, but who knows? We'll find out in the next episode. And I plan on filming the next episode in maybe like an hour when I take a small break. So thank you guys for watching. I had a lot a lot of fun this episode. Uh, Sure, I had a few mistakes, but I think my stealth has been like getting a lot, a lot better. Like I've been using the crossbow, and so far not a single alarm was raised in this episode. So I'm really proud of myself. So thank you guys for watching. Keep an eye out for more content, and also check out my other gameplays, and I'll see you guys next time.